Hello everyone, my name is KK and today we have another discussion about BTD Battles 2. We have a few updates from Ninja Kiwi and you will know everything you need to know about the game today. So, uh, the Ninja Kiwi posted the blog today and we are gonna run through their answers to the questions that players ask them. So, first of all, let me make it clear, there will be no Cobra Tower in the initial release. So Ninja Kiwi does not argue that they might add it in the future, but there is a guaranteed answer that there are no Cobra in Beta the Battles 2. Why there are, there can be a few reasons. First of all, it's gonna be a bit difficult to balance Cobra, but second of all, I'm pretty sure that the Ninja Kiwi wants to promote the variety of strategies in the game. Right now, in Beat the Battles 1, Cobra is widely used because for the new players, this tower seems pretty broken. And in the lower and mid mid tier arenas, like 2000 medallions and lower, a lot of players use this tower to get some medallions and get easy wins. So, in order to prevent this, Ninja Kiwi just <laughs> restricted existence of this tower <laughs> overall. And they might add it in the future, it might be a hero, like in B Bloons Adventure Time, or it might be a t tower like in Bitted the Battles. We don't know as of now. So, okay, this is clear now. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, will Battles 2 have the interactable maps? Uh, like Flowers in, or Ravine Sword in BTD6. So, you'll, uh, the answer, you'll have to wait to see the release when we release more footage. Battles maps will be unique and balanced for Battles 2 gameplay, first and foremost. Not for parity with BTD6. So, it's a smart answer and sounds good to me. Okay, next. How will Beat the Battles 2 be monetized? This is a very important thing, because Beat the Battles is well known about their stupid pop-up ads that are being forced after you lose the match, mainly, if you don't have the club room. So, it is a rather sensitive topic. The answer. As we strive to give all our game do with all our games, there will be no paywall in the Battles 2, which means that the game is free. It is a very good notion, it's like BTD Battles 1, where it's free to download, but there will be ads inside the game. La 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 la. There will, there will be gold pass that will accelerate XP gain. There will be rewarded ads for a similar XP boost outside the gold pass. And the cosmetics will be large part of each season, which will be gated by XP and monkey money earned each season, but not in a conventional linear battle pass way. It's better. Again, we'll have more to, to reveal in the upcoming months. Okay, this is the piece of new information that we need to digest properly. So, listen to me. We are certain right now that we will have some kind of XP. And we know that it's not the XP that re powers require in the battles right now. However, this is most likely. I have a few theories on which XP can it be. It can be it's it, well, I'm almost sure that it won't be leveling up as your like level overall. It will probably will be the hero's XP to boost your towers and maybe g have a few buffs here and there. And it, there is another possibility that it can be the tower XP. That the more you use the tower, the the more XP you get, and thus you will be unlocking either the tier five upgrades, which is kind of reasonable but short-sighted because we'll uh, unlock them eventually very quickly or the buffs or maybe the secret paths upgrade paths that are unlocked only via the xp of towers some something among these variants should be correct gold paths so from this information i understand that we will have to most likely buy the passes monthly. It's not gonna be a one-time purchase like the club room right now. Uh, and this pass, it's 
think about Fortnite. It's similar to For Fortnite season. So you buy the pass, you get more rewards, and you get more XP. And as Ninja KV mentioned, we will have cust new customizations each season, meaning that they are planning to release new skins, probably on Bloons. Blimps, it's obvious, but I'm pretty sure they will be releasing the hero skins in the future. So they are intending to sell the skins. And this is one of the main ways they want to monetize. And of course, there will be the force ads like in the battles right now. Okay. Okay, the same question. Okay, the ever important question. Is BTD Battles 2 going to come out on June on mobile? Uh, it won't be out on June, it will be late 2021, it will be launching on Steam, iOS and Android. Why is this important? Because my admin emailed the NGKB support and Savannah answered that the game is planning to be released on June to July. And we don't have the reason to not to believe them. However, here they contradict themselves and they say that the game will be launching in the late 2021. However, the important thing is how you fra phrase your question. Here they ask specifically, is Beat the Battle still gonna be on mobile? So we know for sure that no mobile version will be released in summer 2021. However, it is possible that the other, the Steam version might be released, but it's still, it's so vague. Like I can't promise you that it will be released, but we have some hints here, here and there. Don't like rely on these hints, but it, it would be nice. It would be nice for sure. Okay. And BTD Battles 2 description said 21 towers. It's a mistake because there will be 22 towers. Not big deal. Okay. And the most is important question. Why can't the engineer monkey build dispensers? Spencer didn't share the blueprints. <laughs> Super joke. Okay. And that's about it. So we are having some more bits and pieces, <laughs> bits and pieces of information about battles too. We have the monetization, like the ads, the some vague release information. I will leave this up to you whether to decide is it gonna be on summer or in the late 2021 because it's kind of unclear at this stage and. We can just be certain that Cobra will not be a part of this game. Fortunately or not, uh, I like Cobra in BD Battles, but I don't mind having it removed. What is your opinion on the Cobra removed? Okay, press the like or the like button right now, depending on what you think about this video, and see ya in the next one.